Joel, just down here. Down here to your left. Uh, so people are saying that during the, the finishing sequence to that, there was a clash of heads. Um, what's your thoughts on that? Did you feel that that was the case? Están dizendo que en el final hay uh, una cabezaza. ¿Qué piensas? Una la cabeza. Uh, fue un choque para ambos. Y bueno, el árbitro mandó continuar y yo continué. Yeah, we stopped. The ref told us to keep going, so I kept going. And how how proud of yourself were you that you got the fight to, to where you knew you had a, a big advantage and and ended up getting that submission? <laughs> Estás muy orgulloso de usted que terminó la, la pelea así. Estoy contento, estoy bueno, sabía que si ganaría sería mi, mi finalización, ¿no? Son 20 victorias, 20 finalizaciones, no creo que no conozco otra manera de ganar. Yeah, I'm happy. Uh, I was happy to get the submission. All my victories come from submission, so I was happy to go in there and get one more. And what's next for you following that win? Um, how soon would you like to get back in the Come back to the top 15. Thank you. Hi, congratulations for your fight. I have a question about that. Uh, there is a fight in Paris between Thiago Moises and Benoit Saint-Denis. Both of them are very close uh, to you on the rankings. Is the winner of this match um, something interesting for you? Thiago Moises and Benoit Saint-Denis are going to fight in Paris. They are very close to you in the ranking. Is it something that interests you? With Thiago Moises, he has fought. Eh, con, con, a menos lo conozco y la verdad que al final son, son luchadores que también pueden ser fácilmente tops, ¿no? Estar dentro del ranking, así que son, pueden ser futuros rivales. Sí, he fought Thiago Moisés before y Benoit Sandri es somebody that I know, so there are two guys that, that are very at the top and two possible, uh, two possible guys that I could fight. Thank you very much. ¿Cómo se sentía? Fighting in London. Obviously, it's been a while since you fought in Europe. Como sentís peleando aquí en Londres? Hay muy tiempo que no pelea en Europa. Hace cuatro años que no peleo en Europa, ¿no? Y la verdad que el volver a pelear con público, el volver a pelear delante de la gente, más con este gran ambiente que hay en Londres, es fantástico, es fabuloso. Yeah, I hadn't fought in Europe in four years, and you know, just just being in front of people and fighting in front of these people here and fighting in London was amazing. And you've got Ilya Teporia doing big things at the moment. There's been talk, Dana White has mentioned, about trying to get the UFC to Spain. How much would that mean to you if you were able to, you and Ilya perhaps, be on, a, on the first card uh, for the UFC in Spain? Dana White says that it's possible the UFC in Spain. Ilya Teporia is in the top. You also, what do you think? UFC Spain 2024 is a fact. It's a fact that it's Podemos confirmar que UFC España está, está ahí a la vuelta de la esquina. Yeah, UFC Spain 2024, it's done, it's going to happen. Uh, we're going to confirm that pretty soon. Hi, John, this is Matt here. This is the first time uh, winning since November 2021. How do you feel against Andre? Esto primer victoria desde novembro 2021. ¿Cómo se sientes? Eh, la verdad que bien. Son casi dos años, ¿no? Sin volver a la senda de la victoria. Eso lo habíamos peleado una vez desde entonces, eh, en 2022 con Arman Sarukian, y fue caemos derrotados. La verdad que hemos vuelto, estamos de regreso y a partir de ahora estaremos más activos. Yeah, I only fought once since then, you know, against Arman, and you know the reality is that I'm back. I'm, I'm here to show that I'm back, back and active. Are you looking to be more active now that you're back? ¿Quieres estar más activo ahora? Eh, sí, desde ahora estaré, estaré bastante más activo. He, he tenido varias lesiones. Iba a regresar en febrero en, en Australia por problemas con el visado. No pude pelear, así que ahora ya volveré, volveré a estar más, más activo y volveré a estar en racha. Yeah, I want to be more active. You know, I had some injuries. I was going to fight in February in Australia. And I had some visa problems, but now I want to stay more active. And are there any dates um, looking ahead to the UFC schedule? Are there any dates that you have earmarked for your next outing? Tiene una fecha que piensa para pelear la próxima pelea? Seguramente antes de que acabe el año estaremos de vuelta. For sure, before the year's over, we'll be back.